Welcome everyone to another quick boss guide at Only Boss Fights. Today is Orod, one of the immortals in Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown. Orod seems to be the powerhouse of the immortals and you will meet him during the celestial quest in the Raging Seas area. Not bad, kid. You managed to get here. A fight between two immortals and no one to see it. <laughs> Let's get this over with. <laughs> I, Orod, the Storm Master, challenge Sargon, the Betrayer. Show me the true spirit of the Rashabar. <laughs> the first thing as soon as the fight starts you want to jump to avoid his charge attack another attack is an uppercut attack with his mighty anchor and then slams it down sending shockwaves out avoid this and try to parry the shockwaves if possible he will also swing the anchor side to side in a wide arc but this can be parried Another move he has is that he will jump and throw, spinning the anchor towards you and then will return to him across the ground. Dodge the anchor and jump over him to get some hits in on his back. At the beginning of phase 2, Orod will have a cutscene of him splitting his anchor and having chains on it. His first attack will be a short shockwave punch and then jump spinning the anchors around him and then charge down with them onto you if you don't dodge them. Another move signalled by wind coming to him is where he spins the anchors around him and if stuck in the circle where these anchors are you get hit multiple times. When there's a short animation this signals his charge attack and he throws the anchors up in the air diagonally from himself you want to jump and dash to stay in the air the longest possible and when you land between attacks you want to jump and dash again to avoid the second attack after this attack he will be down for a bit and time to get as many hits in on him as you can also during this phase Orod will also have an enhanced charge attack where he slams his ankles into the ground and then pulls himself across the arena the final extra move he has will be that he summons a tornado. When you see this, get as close to him as you can, drop a shadow and run for the edge of the arena. Use the shadow before the tornado hits you and get some hits in him again. Orod at phase 3 will power himself up with electricity and turn green. If hit with electricity, you will not be able to use your Afro Surge. For a cooldown timer will be added to it locking it out watch out because all previous moves now have an electric attack added to it if you follow this you should be able to take down the hulking immortal and come out victorious till next boss fight happy gaming Caspian Sea. Cross the Hellbridge of Shinvat for a bet. <clears throat> Crushed Hercules. No one sang about it. But you, you gave me the most glorious fight. Did you kill Hassan? What do you think? <laughs> Don't fight the current. 
Learn to sail in high winds, kid. I'll miss you, brother. <laughs>